are you having difficulties on how to humanize AI generated content? Like you are an article writer, research reports writer, or any type of content writer, and you have tried so many AI humanizer without getting good result that you want. Even the one that seems to be very good are paid for. In this video, I am going to show with you free AI tool that can help you to humanize AI generated content. My name is Pat Ugo for High Seeker Academy. In this channel, we do videos on digital skills. If this is the kind of video you would like to see in the future, please consider subscribing. If you are ready, let's dive in. For us to start, we'll first of all go to ChatGPT in order to generate content for this process. So I will plug in this prompt. In this prompt, I say, write a three paragraph essay on the importance of self-care. After writing this prompt, I will press enter and wait for ChatGPT to generate this content for us. Remember, I said only three paragraph. As you can see, this is the content. ChatGPT is generating it for us. Now, the problem here is that if you submit this essay to your school, they are likely going to detect that you use AI to generate it. And you know that AI is supposed to use for ideation and not for copy and paste. In order to help you, there is a tool that will help you to humanize this content so that it doesn't sound robotic. Before we do that, let us look at what other AI detector tools see about this particular content. So I will highlight it. After highlighting, I will copy. Then the first AI detector tool we are going to use is Zero GPT. So I will put the link in the description box below. I will come here and paste this content. Then ask Zero GPT to check this content, whether it is AI detectable or it sounds human. So I'll click on this button and it will detect it as 100% AI GPT. For us to confirm, we are going to use another AI detector tool. And the name of the tool is Quibbles. Quibbles also has AI content detector. So I will also paste the same content here and ask it to detect. You can see we don't have any percent here. So if I click Detect AI, it will process and also tell me that it has 100% of text is like AI generated. So how do we remove these AI elements in this particular content so that it will not run into problem? For us to do this, we'll go to this new AI tool known as Stilt Writer. Stilt Writer. I will also put the link in the description of this video. Now we are going to plug in the same test. After plugging in the same test, the next thing we need to do is to choose the model you are going to use. We we'll have different models here. For now, we are going to leave it at Ninja 3.2. Then you can as well change the advanced settings. Here, you can ask it to skip code if you have code in your content or you have quotation and things like that. But since we don't have all that, we'll go on to humanize our test. Apart from humanizing tests, you can also use this tool to check if a test is AI generated. By using this button, you can also initiate it from this tab. But for this particular video, we'll just be humanizing this content. So I will click on this button now. Once I click there, it will go on to humanize the test. After that, it has humanized. You can see it here. Now, the next thing I will need to do is to highlight this test, then copy it to those AI detector tools. We are going to use this one. So I will paste the test here and click the test. Remember it was 100% and now it is now 0% AI GPT. How cool is this? 
please subscribe to my channel if you are getting value from this video let us also use the other detector tool to see how many percents we are going to have this is quibbles i will highlight and delete this one paste the new one humanize for us by stealth writer then click on detect ai at this time it is now zero percent i hope you love this you should be very careful if this is for academic work you don't just go to ai to copy it and paste you need to tell your institution how many percent of AI contents you have in your material. You need to declare that. I hope you understand. So if this tool is good for you, you can go for the upgrade. You can go to the upgrade plan. Here, you will have free plan. For this free plan, you can only use 300 words at a time, but you will have access to Ninja model and this can also bypass most detectors. By most detectors, we mean other detector tools. You can see all of them here. Originality, zero GPT, copy leaks, and the rest of them. And again, you can only do 5,000 words per day. If this is a limit to you, you can upgrade to their basic plan where you will have to pay $20 per month. There is also a standard plan of $35 per month and then premium plan of $15 per month. How do you see these two? If you know about any two that is better than this, please leave it in the comment section. And if you would like to learn how to use AI to write academic research reports or to do data analysis, I have courses that are teaching this. The links are in the description box below. Remember to share this video with your loved ones. Until next time, keep learning.